dare you betray the Brotherhood? It's not his fault. It's mine. I'll deal with you in a moment. Knight, why has this... this thing not been destroyed? How did you find us? When I sent you to execute this machine, I suspected you'd have difficulty following my orders. Now that I've arrived, it appears that my instincts were correct. What did it say to you that made you betray the Brotherhood? Why is it still alive? He's still alive. Because you're wrong about him. Him! Dance isn't a man. It's a machine. An automaton created by the Institute. It wasn't born from the womb of a loving mother. It was grown within the cold confines of a laboratory. Flesh is flesh. Machine is machine. The two were never meant to intertwine. By attempting to play God, the Institute has taken the sanctity of human life and corrupted it beyond measure. After all I've done for the Brotherhood, all the blood I've spilled in our name, how can you say that about You're the physical embodiment of what we hate most. Technology that's gone too far. Look around you, Dance. Look at the scorched earth and the bones that litter the wasteland. Millions, perhaps even billions, died because science outpaced man's restraint. They called it a new frontier and pushing the envelope, completely disregarding the repercussions. Can't you see the same thing is happening again? You're a single bomb in an arsenal of thousands, preparing to lay waste to what's left of mankind. Dance wants to save mankind, not destroy it. You're as delusional as you are insubordinate. How can you trust the word of a machine that thinks it's alive? A machine that's had its mind erased, its thoughts programmed, its very soul manufactured. Those ethics that it's striving to champion aren't even its own. They were artificially inserted in an attempt to have it blend into society. It's true. I was built within the confines of a laboratory. And some of my memories aren't my own. But when I saw my brothers dying at my feet, I felt sorrow. When I defeated an enemy of the Brotherhood, I felt pride. And when I heard your speech about saving the Commonwealth, I felt hope. Don't you understand? I thought I was human, Arthur. From the moment I was taken in by the Brotherhood, I've done absolutely nothing to betray your trust. And I never will. It's too late for that now. The Institute has foolishly chosen to grant you life. You simply should not exist. I don't intend to debate this any longer. My orders stand. It's all right. We did our best. You convinced me that I was wrong to be ashamed of my true identity. And I thank you for it. Whatever you decide. Know that I'm going to my grave with no anger and no regrets. Touching. Either you execute Dance, or I will, Knight. The choice is yours. After all the sacrifices I've made, and all the battles I've fought for the Brotherhood, you need to listen to me. You owe me that much. Very well. I'm listening. Whether he's human or not, Dance saved the lives of countless Brotherhood soldiers. Now it's time you saved his. You're a stubborn man. So, it appears we've arrived at an impasse. Allowing Dance to live undermines everything the Brotherhood stands for. Yet you insist that he remains alive. Which leaves me with only a single alternative. Dance, as far as I'm concerned, you're dead. You were pursued and slain by this Brotherhood Knight. And your remains were incinerated. From this day forward, you are forbidden to set foot on the Pridwin, or speak to anyone from the Brotherhood of Steel. Should you choose to ignore me, know you'll be fired upon immediately. Do we understand each other? I do. Thank you for believing in me, Arthur. Don't mistake my mercy for acceptance. The only reason you're still alive is because of him. I'm returning to the Pridwin Knight. Take some time. Say your goodbyes. And then I expect to see you there. We still have the Institute to deal with. Hey. It took a hell of a lot of guts to stand up to Maxim like that. So what are you gonna do now? I've decided to stay here. I didn't plan on sp- mm -hmm. Besides, you're still gonna need my help. Now, you better get back to the Pridwin. If you ever need me- Uh-huh. 
Can't you come with me now? You heard what Maxon said. If I'm seen aboard the Pridwin, at the police station, or at the airport, not only would I be killed, I'd undermine his authority. I won't do that. But if you need me to take the fight anywhere else, I'll be there. What about Halen? I don't think Maxon knew she was involved, so she'll be safe. I'll contact her and let her know what happened here. It's the least I could do. Are you gonna have a problem killing synths? I might physically be a synth, but my heart and mind belong to the Brotherhood. The Institute is still a tremendous... I promise you, I will... Goodbye, Dance. Farewell. I hope the next time we meet, it will be under happier circumstances. <laughs>